And in terms of those mitigations for the dangers of isolated or remote working, yeah. can you share with us a few of those mitigations? Of yeah, sneak preview, definitely. <laughs> um, so, uh, yeah, so there's um, things that sound obvious, but then we can give you a bit of nuance about them. So the first thing, obviously, is uh, the potential for severe isolation. Um, and the risk of that are all those things I've said. So, you know, around uh, tiredness and lack of motivation and, and those kind of things. Um, so what you need is to arrange for ways of having like high quality, regular social contact. And that's not just between workers and their managers, which is obviously useful and necessary, but also between workers and their co-workers so that your team cohesion doesn't suffer in that way. And also workers and people who they might have met if they went out networking in some other way. You know, it's our profession professional lives are also marked by learning from others outside of our organizations and opening up our minds to training new things um, so when when we're talking about contact it's not just that immediate oh yes we've set up video conferencing that's fine it's also thinking about the ways in which we contact all those people who we would otherwise have not had contact with so for instance um, healthcare workers in rural Australia um, were not feeling backed up in difficult situations. So if they had a stressful situation, um, then they didn't know who to turn to, to debrief, that kind of thing. So that's a really important point. If someone's had a stressful situation at work, is there anyone they can turn to and, and do they know how to do it? Um, but also uh, ongoing professional development for them was the same. You know, it was kind of like if, if all the training courses are in the city and I have to be away for a week to go to the city and I can't do it, I don't get the same ongoing professional development as others. Um, so yeah, so finding ways to do those things uh, will be really important. Um, it's not just, oh yes, we've got, we've had a video conference once a week, we're all fine.